Hi guys, this is Michelle Marie Tani. I got my glasses on because I'm walking home. I just got done taking care of the cable TV thing. And this year, we're going to be doing a lot of new material, new topics, new themes, new, well, everything. We got to cover, first of all, in a very short video, uh, is why we have been off the air for, two, for almost a year. And then I thought I would start by explaining this to you. It's hard to see in the dark. <laughs> it's because I mean, it's just the light is uh, it's hard to see in the outside. So, all right. So let me mind that. Let me just explain what we're talking about. In the last few months, they've been doing some work on our porch last summer, starting from March until October. I couldn't actually enter my apartment to really do any videos because, unfortunately, there was no place to go. Because Except in the yellow house I was in, which was fine. But you know what the problem was? It was very noisy in there with a lot of people. And so I didn't get a chance to do that. And, uh, yeah, so that's the reason. I don't usually wear my glasses on camera, but I'm wearing my glasses because I'm walking. You know, I gotta see where the hell I'm going, right? Okay, so let's get to the point. I'm just trying to run this video on this. Use this as an intro. As I'm walking back here from the game, coming back to Winston, back to my apartment, um, I wanted to. Oh, why don't I sit down? It'd be easier. That's a handicap ramp. I know that. Uh, you can't. You, there's no place to sit. You know what, Winston? You guys really need benches. Seriously, okay. Um. Anyway, so. My battery and my phone is running down, so I gotta make this count for every millivolt leaving my battery. So let's get started with the facts. Number one, there's a. Uh, it's it's nice right now outside when I when I'm taping this. Uh, but you know what? Here's the problem. I don't think you really understand how much work has to go in to do our videos on YouTube and and now the, we're back at the cable company again um it takes a lot of work to do a good video and a good video takes a good planning a good topic in order to guarantee that you're going to stick around and watch it okay is that a chair? no the bleachers are done. I know he's got bleachers there's another footpath over here by bleachers. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to sit down for a little bit here. Um, not because my leg's hurting yet, because it's not. I actually, walking and talking in some states during a vlog like this is actually considered illegal. Um, which is not quite that bad. But, here I am. I'm at Walker Field. I'm just going to sit down for a little bit. So, anyway, to make a long story short, there's a funny story about these benches. They used to be metal. Uh, long story with that, what happened to the metal benches? <laughs> Some, if I got this right, it, yes, I think Winston was one of those towns that was... Um, robbed of the metal benches. Okay. They actually had to replace them with wood. Which is fine. Wood is more forgiving anyway. I never had a problem with wood. Alright, so let me get started. The, uh, it's, it's a really, it's going to be really fun this year. We're going to have so much material to cover. we got the, the Republican uh, convention to cover. We got the uh, election, the general election to cover. We got um, the Democratic convention to cover. We have the local events to cover. We have all this stuff. And yeah, we're going to cover all that stuff. I promise you that. But right now, uh, at this point, this weather is just nice enough that I'm able to get out here and do something. 
and uh, that's what I'm gonna do. But I'm gonna just let me just wrap this up and say one more thing before I go because I don't know how much more my battery can take. Please keep watching. We're gonna be doing new things, new topics, new themes, new stories. Uh, and as far as the intro you saw at the beginning of the video, technically we need to redo that too. Why? Well, because you see the um, the landlord re interior painted the place, so what you saw from my doorway is no longer the same doorway. It's just it's such a it's such a comfortable video and it's such a it's such an inviting video. I just don't want to erase it. It's just it's just. It's it's dated. It's it's no longer applies anymore. So what we'll do is um, we're going to show you what it looks like now coming into the building, going up the stairs, and you'll get a chance to see it as now. Okay. All right, guys. So let's go. Ah, yes, the Snow Queen Palace. Why do we call it that? Well, it turns out the Snow Queen Palace is where I live. Duh. That's why. But then we, let's take a quick look at the inside. And then we're going to show you the interior of my apartment as well. And yeah, I'm going to show you. Give me a new intro. I'll make a new intro at the side of this video too. Let's see how it goes. Okay? Well, first of all, the front of the building hasn't changed your health a lot. It's pretty much the same. Um, it, you don't really see the difference until you get inside. Yeah, this broken, cracked glass is still here. Of all the things my landlord did to fix up the place, you would think he would have done something with that, right? Oh, he didn't, so. Okay, now, let's see now. This place has been repainted. Get my mail here. Oh, uh, okay, S student, all right, so I want to make credit card debt, so let's go up the stairs here. Now, let me show you what else has been remained the same on the coming in. We still have the same color railings we had before. He didn't change those. These railings are original paint. They weren't redone. Okay, so let's go upstairs here. You can see uh, the hallways look the same, except the colors are different. Looks like Mr. Landlord ran out of paint in places. He was he painted his door with a black trim, and that's the only room. Yes, that's my landlord's door right there. Okay, this is where things get. By the way, he put uh, this call these. This is kind of a gray paint. It's, it's not bad. Ugh. He painted those. This is my door. And let's see if we can get my keys out of here. I still have the same wreath on it, but that's about it. They painted over from a glass. Okay. So anyway, let's get this going. Welcome to my world, guys. Come on in. <sighs> This is the apartment in the interior. I did a video on this a couple of years ago. Um, that's sorry, it's a little dark in here. I didn't turn lights on. This is my uh, entryway. <sighs> bathroom. They never repainted this. This is still the same bathroom. Design as it originally was. I still have my Harpy Twins on the wall. Um, what do I know? It looks like Melissa. Vent. <laughs> this is the multimedia studio. This is the one we've used for a lot of our videos in the past. Right now, it's kind of 
It come more like multi storage of anything. And of course, our old studio where we do most of our videos. Here's a rusty the kitty. Hi, Mr. Cat. Do you want to say hi to the audience? Yeah. He's growing up. He's a full grown cat now. Um, and of course, the place you will be working very quickly is our multimedia setup here. This is the computer. This is our Parmac T5. The white box on the bottom is the video caption unit. The thing on the top is an Intel modem for the deaf. And then, of course, on top of that is a hard drive. And we've okay, got our 21-inch monitor. Our DeskJet 540 inkjet printer on top. Our Lexmark E232 laser printer. Over here we have our Dell tape drive. Then we used to back up our medium. Our scanner for scanning and images. Our heater will need a little bit of heat, extra heat in cold nights. Which, at the time of recording, is the 29th of April. We're probably not going to be needing that much longer. So that takes care of that. And of course... My messy, lumpy mattress. Believe me, when I was sleeping in the yellow house, the mattress was actually the most important thing I actually enjoyed having. That's when I came back here. Because I missed my bed. Okay. Now we get into the kitchen. You'll notice that, unlike before, our walls in our apartment are pink. This is actually a drop cloth. I bought the valence at Target and I bought the... They were using this as a drop cloth. They need curtains to match the walls. So it wasn't too badly stained with paint, so I'm using it as a curtain. This is our electronics system that runs all the phones in the building and the multimedia and internet and everything. I went this up and said kitty cats can go in and out on the new porch. And I'm going to show you that real quickly here. Yeah, one door he didn't paint. I wonder why. <laughs> this door really needed paint. The new porch. Now the porch is kind of cool because it's um, it's got these LED lights in the ceiling now. They are on the dawn to dusk sensors, and uh. It has much better than the original porch. This is my storage bin right here. This is where I keep my outdoor stuff. Yes, the TV works. Yeah, I should put the mirror in the closet too, shouldn't I? Yeah, I do have a key to my storage bin. So, uh, so my problem is I'm still learning how to do this key. It's my storage bin. So let me put this... Well, don't drop it. Glass. I know I got it. Okay. See, secure there. See, it's not really huge in here, but you can hold some things in here. These are the original, original uh, 1860 clapboards. They just painted them. This is an uh. uh change in any other way. I don't want hoodlums in my storage bin, so. Alright, so that's it. Um, and uh, we could try walking down the stairs, but I don't know if I have enough battery. So I'll, I'll take a video about that one a little later on. I charged my battery up enough. We're going to show you the downstairs and the back of the building. So that's where we're going to go now. We're going to go down the back stairs so you can see what it looks like. So we're going to put the camera towards me and you and try to show you at the same time. Now the original stairs, these railings are much more secure for the people with the Americans with Disabilities Act. And you can see the treads on the steps. Uh, I know they're dirty. 
they're also much wider. You can see, unlike the original steps, where they weren't so wide. These are much wider steps, okay? And, um, the general, um, shape of the porch is the same. Again, you get four storage units down here as well. And it's, some people get a lot of foot traffic. I don't know why my landlord painted it white. I think that was a bad color schema. Um, so let's take a look at the the cat. Something's the same, or in general design. Um, this here is still a storage utility area downstairs. And there's the yellow house I stayed in during the summer. Uh, and this is the stairs going down. And you see that it looks like you're still getting more of the, um, the dawn to dusk light sensors. He did make some changes in here, um, downstairs. So one of the things was, is they redid the, um, area underneath here where the steps are. I'm gonna, just trying to get all this into one video is really hard because, um, this is not really easy. Okay. So they can see now the porch. Let me walk up back over here far enough so you can see better the porch uh, structure you can see it's a um, oh yes by the way my landlord did make a few changes um, first of all besides this is all new there is not a door that slides this way anymore it goes up and there's a garage door he cleaned up all the excessive cable wires that were like Pardon my French, like, friggin' burying everything. You can see you've only got rid of all those cables and cleaned up the, the cables. Uh, got some new cable TV wires over there, but it has nothing else. By the way, my landlord did also make one change you can't see. Um, he switched to gas heat. Um, so we don't have oil heat anymore. It's natural gas now. Um... Yeah, the original cellar door. New step down into the cellar. And if you were to go on the side of the building, I'm not going to go in there because it's always overgrown with weeds. You'll see the new gas meter installation, which really, I don't think you need to see that. Um, so, that's pretty much all of it. Um, and so, I mean, this video is more of anything. It was more of a tour of a chance for you to get to see what the apartment building looks like. Uh, it's not quite finished. Uh, we have a lot of work to do, um, to make things. One thing I promise you, you're going to find out is how to get all those videos, um, in order. Oh, don't worry about that one. I got the cupboard. So, anyway, so, this is a strange thing. Why did he do this? He's like, you would have thought that they would have either, I'm sure there must have been some reason because of uh, health and safety they did this, but this is, this is such a, I always thought this part was kind of silly. Like we're going up the stairs. I mean, they made some main, they made some nice changes. They made the steps very wide, which is great. Um, the night, this porch ain't no dark place. It's almost as bright as it is right now in the daytime. So, he's moving on from CFLs to LEDs. So, 
Lots of light. Lots of light. Oh, yeah. You ain't getting up on that roof anymore. Because there's no longer a ladder up there. Back inside, I gotta take care of some chores. And uh, things like that. So, I got a chance to see a little bit of the Snow Queen Palace interior. And uh, we will do some more videos and more material as we go. Okay? Hey, did you know there's a lot more going on right now at our websites? Are you watching all four of them? If not, check them out. There's a list right here. We got three YouTube channels and one audio-only channel for your enjoyment. So come on and dig in and see all the stuff we do here at the North American Snow Queen Palace.